But this morning I caught a new Netflix release called His Three Daughters. Oh. Uh, this, yeah, written and directed by Azazel Jacobs. And it stars Carrie Coon, Natasha Leone, and Elizabeth Olsen as uh, three sisters who are uh, getting together to watch and be around their dad as he dies. Uh, this movie is incredible. The, the, the three sisters are coming together from three different places, three different perspectives. You've got, you've got Carrie Coon, who's the older sister who lives across town, visits once a month or so just to check in. And she is the one that has to take care of all the logistics, right? She's the one trying to write the obituary. She's the one that's making, making meals for everybody. Then you've got Elizabeth Olsen, who's the the one who just cares for everyone and has, is the emotional center. And she's the one that's always checking in and making sure everyone is OK and everyone is happy and everyone's at peace. And then there's Natasha Leone, who is the stepsister. And she's the one that's been living with dad and taking care of him. And so the other two are like, oh, this is such a special moment that we're all here. And she's like, this is Tuesday. I don't know what I don't see what the problem is. And I got to go watch the Bulls play because I got a six game parlay going on on that thing. So uh, it, it, it's a perfect Natasha Leone part. These three, they're, they, they clash in such a perfect way. And watching them navigate, it's so true to real life. Like if you've seen any like family dynamics around, especially around when the, the one thing that brings you all together is about to leave, it's it's such it's so true. And it's such a beautiful portrait of that. It does some weird stuff at the end. I'll just say that you can kind of get behind because it works. It's a four star movie. I loved this movie and all three of these deserve a lot of recognition for, for what they did in this movie. Um, yeah, it's on Netflix. Watch his three daughters. It is an emotional gut punch, but you're going to be, it's one of those where, You'll feel better as a human being for watching it. Yeah, yeah I, I kind of forgot that it was I out liked this it. Week. <clears throat> oh, Go ahead, Todd. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I I saw it too. I was just saying, I I, I oh. like it too. I I didn't uh, I didn't I mean I didn't not give it a four stars. I'm not like a high three stars, but I, I do I do think the 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 three actresses are really really good. And and yeah, and Natasha Leone is like the she's Natasha Leone. She's like the, the, the quirky character. But, uh, I think Carrie Coon is amazing in this. I think she's going to get an Oscar nomination for this movie. So it's, uh, but yeah, I mean, I, I, I do like the movie and I, I, I've never like really loved, uh, one of this director's movies before. Like, uh, they've, they've all been like sort of fine. This one is definitely his best movie. So I, I do really like the that. ending. It does some weird stuff at the end, but yeah, I like it. Yeah. I'd forgotten about it. I'll watch it at some point this week. I uh, d disagree with Todd. I really like Azazel Jacobs in particular. I really like The Lovers and Mama's Man. Those are both awesome movies. So I think French he's Exit a really is trash. Movie. Terry I'm not is pretty Exit. trash. <laughs> the Lovers is fine. I, I, I do I do kind of like it. All right. Well, there you go. Well, I'm glad I'm glad Todd you at least liked the like the movie. And yeah, I think all three of them are great. But yep. yeah, Carrie Coon Carrie Coon is great. Elizabeth Olsen, I, I think I think she's a standout for me. You're right. Natasha Leone is just kind of doing Natasha Leone, uh, but she's it, but it works and it fits really well. But Elizabeth Olsen is, yeah, I think she's they all have she's, their moments. She's a standout for me. They all have. You're right. They all do have their moments, including the boyfriend. Like that's a good moment too. Um, okay, Zach needs to watch it. I'm sure we'll talk about it again next week. <laughs>